Getting shots into the arms of seniors is a challenge. Dr. Amy Sisson, Yolo County Health Department says seniors must be prioritized over younger essential workers. In Yolo County, we analyzed mortality rates by age and found that a vaccine given to a Yolo County resident 65 or older is 141 times more likely to save a life than a vaccine given to a resident younger than 50. So why aren't people 65 and over getting priority access within tier groups? One reason, according to Dr. Sisson, guidance from the state of California keeps changing. Decisions about vaccine prioritization must be rooted in science and insulated from political pressures. Another factor, seniors tend to be less connected to technology, according to Dr. Sisson. Computers, email, text messages, our social media, the easiest way, fastest way to get information out, but that is not how we are having success in, in reaching the 65 and older community. And finally, access. Dr. Paul Simon with the Los Angeles County Department of Public Health says getting seniors to large vaccination sites has been difficult. To ramp up volume in LA County, we've, we've opened uh, six very large large pods, points of dispensing, and um, that's been very successful in getting more vaccine in people's arms, but it hasn't addressed the equity issue. The, those groups that you know may most need vaccine aren't always well served by these large pods, particularly seniors, but also uh, among racial and ethnic groups. To get more shots into the arms of seniors, both Dr. Sisson and Simon agree it's going to take a boots on the ground approach. For example, we are organizing mobile teams to bring vaccinations next week directly to seniors living in senior housing developments or accessing senior centers in our hardest hit communities. In Sacramento, Brittany Johnson, KCRA 3 News. Counties are also using the 211 resource saying for those who don't have the ability to find information online, because that's for some, and they can't sign up to get the vaccine online, they can then call 211.